What's going on, Hard Chargers? I am Rios, a.k.a. Chelly Chell, and I am the Sar Major affiliate. Check it out. If y'all enjoy the real raw content that I am putting out, then make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also, if you like this video that you're about to watch, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. And if you dislike it, hit the thumbs down and let me know in the comments why you liked it and why you disliked it. Mission, discuss why a coach, mentor, and father figure is important. Situation, at an annual Thomas Edison alumni basketball game in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, remembering a great coach, Howard Ratnoff. Outcome, as a result of this discussion, viewers will understand why a coach, mentor, and father figure is important. All right, Hard Chargers, I'm here with Tony Booz, who is alumni of the Edison basketball team and a 1996 champion. And Tony, I'm gonna ask you a couple questions, right? Why is a coach, mentor, and a father figure very important? Um, it's very important because the uh, community we are in now is like, it's kind of like messed up. So it's very important that everybody stay together. And that's about all. So with that being sure, understanding that this is a, a remembrance of your coach, all of our coach, Coach Ratnoff. Describe Coach Ratnoff in one word. Father figure. And elaborate why you say that. Well, he was always there for everyone. Like, even people that wasn't on the team, people that just went to the school, he was always there for everyone. A real uh, good guy, a real great guy. I appreciate you, Tony, for that. Hey, take care of yourself. It's great seeing you, brother. What's going on, Hard Chargers? I'm here with Corey Seabrook, Edison alumni, 90, 91. And I'm gonna ask you, Corey, I'm gonna ask you some questions. Why is a coach, mentor, and father figure important? Well, because simply, you know, a coach is someone that puts you in, put you in a proper position to succeed and be successful. And that prepares you for life because they also teaches you how to, you know, be successful in life. And they guide you in that manner. And as a father figure, you know, when you're in a school environment, you're not around your parents. So you have somebody there that you can go to and talk to about your problems, even when you're having problems at home or in school. Is a constantly, they always there. You can talk to them. If you were to describe Coach Ratton up in one word, what would that be? Honorable. And why, elaborate why you say honorable. Because he was a man's man. My father would say he's a man's man because he would lead by example, like his honesty, he didn't cheat the system. He was always fair, but he also wanted you to be your best, even in school or out of school. Because some sometimes you will have a coach that if you messing up in school, they won't really say nothing. They'll probably, you know, adjust it, address the teacher like he needs some help. But he would try to get you to bring the best out of you instead of, you know, shortcutting the system. And he wants you to become a man. So. Look, I hope I hope y'all picking up these gems that Corey put out there because it's very important, especially in this day in life for, for our youngest and, and some of y'all older folks to understand these things. Hey, Corey, Corey Seabrook. Thank you, brother. What's going on, Hard Chargers? I'm here with Bug, Edison alumni, 
90 through 92. And what's going on, Bug? I'm gonna ask you some questions. So, first one is, why is a mentor, a coach, and father figure important? It's important because, you know, those are all like leaders. And they teach the people coming up behind, you know, whether it be their children, their players, or the people that they mentor, they teaching them, they showing them the way. So whatever those those leaders are teaching the, the next people coming up, that's what they're gonna follow. So it's, it's, it's critical. Roger that, Roger that, and I dig that. So, you know, you being with Coach Ratanoff, and you see he has the picture with Coach Ratanoff right here. Um, describe one word that you would call Coach Ratanoff. Um, Coach Rat, I would say, uh, genuine and why you elaborate why you pick genuine well because no matter who, who played for him no matter who you were your background your race it didn't matter he genuinely cared about everybody he did everything he could like he would show up you know he was there always with an open door a lot of people talk about it but he really was about it so he was just a genuine man okay so he uh he meant a lot to you with you going on in life at the high school Oh, he made a big difference for me. You know, he was he was a real father figure for me. You know, and I was hard to handle. You know, I, I was into a lot of things and I was, you know, wild. And he really, you know, stuck in there. Didn't, it didn't change his love for me. He always was there for me. And um, you know, he treated me he treated me well regardless. So without him, I mean, it, it changed the whole trajectory of my life. Roger that. Hey, Bug, I appreciate you, brother, taking them gems, youngins. What's going on, Hard Chargers? Look, I have the honor here to be with Jermaine Tab. He is the director of this alumni Edison uh, basketball game that's been going on for 13 years since what, 09? Since right? 2009, yes, correct. Also, um, and, and he incorporated with everything with the memory of Coach Ratanoff and doing things for the community and these kids. Um, oh, also, he is alumni since 90 through 94. Jermaine, well, Tad, I'm gonna ask you a couple questions. So, why is a coach, mentor, and father figure important? It's important because, as always, you always gotta give back to the youth. You know what I mean? The youth right now, you gotta give back to them or whatever, because it's important. You know what I mean? Coach Ratanoff, he gave back to us told us, you know, what was life about, and he always told us about giving back. So, this is this is one great question I've been asking other people, but describe Coach Ratnoff in one word. Okay. Coach Ratnoff, a father figure. I mean, always showed love. Even my senior year, when I was graduating, I was taking the SAT at Edison High School. Coach Ratnoff used to live in Bryn Mawr. This man came all the way down to Temple University to make sure that I was fine, you know, for me to get ready to take the SAT. So that was important to me because at that point in time, I didn't have a father figure at home at my house. It was just me, my mom, and my own two sisters and my three brothers. So Coach Rat, he was a father figure. And he was a father figure to a lot of other guys who he mentor here at Edison. Wow, that was great. And I'm glad that you elaborated and tied that into there. Let me just ask you one more thing. Um, so. Coach Ratnaw was um, a big person that helped you, like, when when you became outside of high school and everything. Yeah, Coach Ratnaw, he helped me um, big time or whatever. Um, always, ask, He always used to ask me, like, you know, meaning of words. Like, when I used to come to school here, I used to always see Coach Ratnaw reading, like, a dictionary or whatever like that. And he used to always ask me, what do these words mean? And he always used to say, yo, you gotta understand what words mean or whatever like that, or whatever. But not only that, everyone who had came through here, here at Edison High School, from when he was at the old Edison at A from Lehigh, he always cared about the young men. You know what I mean? Always was there for him, always. Hey, man, that's, that's gems that 
everybody need to know i thank you i am proud i am edison alumni 93 to 97 and don't act like y'all don't know who the hell i am in philadelphia number 82 i didn't get off the field my last three years in playing football so people know whoever's watching this you'll know but i'm proud of this guy right here because not too many people doing stuff for the community for something to keep things alive no matter if somebody come or not you like you gotta do it and get back tab my brother Yo, as y'all just heard from some of the great men from the Thomas Edison alumni basketball team, you heard them talk about how Coach Ratnoff was to them in life as a coach, mentor, and a father figure. That's a big deal. That's what we need in this life today. Because having a person who's either a coach, a mentor, or a father figure could be a big deal to yourself in life when you head out of high school, college, or whatever it is. We need those. So, because you hear how what some of these guys said, they talked about Coach Randolph, they said, you know what? He was honorable, trustworthy, genuine, and definitely a father figure. He didn't hold no punches. He told it like it was. And these guys, no matter what, you know, Coach Ratnoff had to let them go. They go through their own experiences, but that stuck in them. That stuck in them. Now look at now how they coming back and giving back because they remember these things because that is so important for young men, young women, no matter what in life today to be able to go with and, and be a better person and give back. It's a big deal because you know what? Life ain't gonna stop. Life is not gonna take a knee. This is reality. Stop listening to those out there with all this sensitive take. Oh, it's gonna be okay. And this stuff that's not reality. This is reality. Who's gonna be there for you? Who? But you know what? Person who's a coach, mentor, father figure, is still something in you that when you out there at the end of the day, you gotta do for self and alone, that you're able to move forward and figure out, man, and get these things done. Because understand, this is not gonna be easy. I'd like to definitely send a shout out to Tab, the man who for 13 years has been directing this, man, and, and keeping stuff together. Shout out to the Ratnall family um, um, for everything coming through, you know, helping out. And you know what? Y'all keep doing this. It's just gonna keep on for generations to, to help others, to help the new generation coming in at my high school, Thomas Edison in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. I'm the Sergeant Major of Philly, and I got you six. I'm Fuck Yourself Always Hard Chargers. Philly 7 out.